All right, here was my goat list. <laughs> this one might be awful, but I was just bored and did this on my phone. Jones 1, GSP 2, DJ 3, Fedor 4, Aldo 5, Habib 6, Anderson 7, Volk 8, since he lost to Ilya Tapuria, 9, Usman, 10, Adesanya, 11, Stipe, 12, Holloway, 13, Matt Hughes, 14, DC, 15, Cejudo, 16, Kotor, 17, Dominic Cruz, 18, BJ Penn, 19, Tito Ortiz, 20, Velasquez, 21, Liddell, 22, how is McGregor there? What, what's happened here? <laughs> How's McGregor there? Uh, Makashev, 23, Oliveira, 24, Sterling, 25, Edgar, 26, Dillashaw, 27, Whitaker, 28, Poirier, 29, and Shamrock, 30. I think the new generation don't get enough credit in the uh, GOAT list. Bro named everyone. <laughs> yeah. I feel like the new generation doesn't uh, get enough credit in the GOAT list. But when you really look at their records, it's like, damn, dude, this is way better than the former champions of their time. Like Whitaker, look at his wins. Dude, people don't. There are, are champions with multiple defenses that don't have that resume. Do not have that resume at all. Yeah, I haven't put Pereira in there. I don't know why I haven't put Pereira in there. As Again, I just did this on my phone. I think I was shitting while I did this. No, not Rampage. What the fuck? Anderson's losses uh, definitely affect his uh, GOAT list placement for sure. He lost like 10 fights in a row. Throw that list in the bin. Can someone tell me why and um, who should be above who rather than all just saying bad list? Where the fuck is Bilal? Okay. Machida? No, Machida's not on there. You got Machida above Poirier? Come on, dude. Nowhere. Resume-wise, no chance. Get Cruz out of there. Cruz is at, uh, Cruz at number 17. He's the bantamweight goat consensus. You got to have him at 17, at least. You can't have him out of the list. I don't care if you got the belt. UFC back in the day, you could win your debut and get a title shot. It's different. People used to win tough and give their champion of their division a run for their money. You've got a favor than the modern era. <laughs> Thank you for the $2. JDM ruined Bilal's title shot and Bilal is 35. <laughs> Thank you for the membership, crack dog. Appreciate that. One, Cody Brundage. Two, Parker Porter. Three, Jimmy Crew. Yeah. Usman above at Khabib Loki. Okay. But Usman's now 0-3 in his last three fights, you know. Habib too high. Habib might be too high, but none of you are saying Aldo's too high. I don't know if Habib's too high. Habib might have to be there. Who do I put Habib below? Usman, Adesanya, Stipe, Holloway. He's below all of these, you think? I don't know if he's below all of them. I know he's there because he didn't fucking continue to fight and he retired and, and therefore he's undefeated, but it's a pretty good record. Pretty good. Under He's the lightweight GOAT. Lightweight's the most difficult uh, division in the sport. He's the GOAT of that division. So you got to have him up there. I got the featherweight GOAT above him. I got the heavyweight ab a GOAT above them. The flyweight GOAT above that. The welterweight goat above that. The light heavyweight goat before that. I don't think you can have a non-goat of a division above a goat of a division, especially lightweight. Maybe Habib's too high, though. Nah, not JDS. Where the fuck is Francisco Goat Nalda? Yeah, true. I forgot about Francisco Goat Nalda. Get rid of Fedor and Kotor. No, you got to put Fedor on Kotor. Kotor was a double champ. Um, you got you to have Fedor in there. You got to have Kotor in there. You got to have Kotor. JDM is two on the GOAT list at least. Yeah, true. You guys have put Usman over Habib. Where the fuck is Francisco GOAT now, though? Chat, what wins are better? Poirier, Gaethje, and McGregor or Covington, Masvidal, and Burns? Because it's the same selection of wins that they had. I'd 100% I'd say the lightweights are better than the welterweights in terms of defending against. Come on, Covington, Masvidal, Burns. Up against, you know, and Prime Woodley. Prime Woodley's in there as well, to be fair. Yeah, you don't consider that bit as much. Mm. 
Was it really a prime Woodley? Well, considering a loss is the only thing that dictates if anyone's in their prime or out of it. Um, yeah. Don't start acting like that's not why we say people are in their prime and they're not. If someone loses, they're conveniently out of their prime. Unless they happen to go on a win streak afterwards, then they're back in their prime. That's all it is at the end of the day. You forgot Peyton Tabber. I did forget Peyton Tabber. You're right. Triple C should be higher. So Triple C should be above Dimitri, uh, Daniel Cormier and Matt Hughes. I don't think so. I don't think so at all. You know what? I just don't think so at all. Maybe Kane should be lower, yeah. But, you know. Aljo, Leon, Aldo. Aldo's at number five. Leon's not on there yet, but I think if he gets another defense, he'll make his, his uh, debut on the list. Um, but yeah. Woodley was 36. Okay. But Volk just lost to Ilya Tapuria. So if you want to put Volk there, now we've got to start saying, where does Ilya Tapuria belong? That's the annoying thing. Khabib, greater than Usman, quality over quantity, plus he's the lightweight goat. I think so as well. Pat Barry. No, Pat Barry's not on the GOAT list. But I would grape till if they fought right now. He would. He would. At middleweight, maybe not, though. Maybe he would get chinned. Paddy is number one. Okay. Till a B blower. How far off the list is Vadum? I don't know who's off the list. Volk should be higher than number eight. If Volk didn't lose to Ilya Tapuria, he'd be at like number four. Or number three above DJ. But he lost to Ilya. We've got to consider that. Where's Gamrot? Um, yeah, he's not on the list unless he uses his telekinesis to shatter the knee of John Jones apart. Um, Gary finding out McGregor fucks his own wife. What do you mean you do your own wife? I've never heard of something so insane in me fucking life. How are you going to know the kid's not yours? <laughs> What do you mean, how am I going to know the kid's not mine? I'm supposed to know the kid's mine, you fucking freak. <laughs> You're making it so you, there's a chance the kid's not going to be yours. 